Hello Diamond Painters and Jolie and I want to say welcome to my channel. This is the first time for you. If it's not, I want to say thank you for coming back. Sorry I have not done a video in forever. I haven't got any diamond paintings in. Uh, I haven't completed one because I'm still working on one. I'm almost done, but it's starting to give me some trouble, which I'll show you near the end of the video. But I want to hurry up and get this video going because I have a bunch of things to do today. And this is actually a gift, a couple of gifts in here for two people. My daughter's teacher, she's a kindergarten teacher, and for her bus driver, her afternoon bus driver, because she only has half day, her afternoon bus driver fought and got her bus stop switched for me and made it safer for her to get off the bus and for me to get to my house with her. So she deserves something. So I ordered this from AliExpress, didn't think it was gonna be in. And tomorrow is the last day before Christmas vacation for them, so I have to get this stuff done tonight. Sealed, spray, give it to them tomorrow. <laughs> so I'm like, woohoo, gotta get things done, but I have a hundred other things on my plate today also. So like I said, from AliExpress, and like I said, I miss seeing unboxings from AliExpress, but to be honest, I kind of understand why a lot of people doesn't, doesn't, a lot of people don't go through AliExpress that much. I've had problems with three deliveries that I placed on their 1111 big sale. Two orders went to totally different addresses. One to Florida, one to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I live in Pennsylvania, so I don't understand why the other one went to Florida. I tried to um, intercept the one going to Philadelphia, but it was too late. Then another one, the third one, was in limbo in Connecticut and all three packages were supposed to go to Connecticut for my mom so I'm so happy that the third one actually went to my mom and got there I actually had a federal agent call me to double check she got the package that was crazy but um whatchamacallit the other two yeah I had to put disputes in and I got my money back because I use that tracker app that um Ella was talking about in her video which was awesome so I screenshot saying where it went to it doesn't give you the physical address but it gives you the city and the state and the zip code and that right there tells them um, it does not match the city state and zip code it was supposed to go to in the first place so the dispute was easy fast one seller wouldn't even communicate with me I'm asking him what address did you use um, what did you write wrong? What went wrong? Did you give me the wrong tracking maybe? You know, I'm trying to give them the benefit of the doubt. Never got back to me. Then one got back to me and they were like, oh, just put in dispute. Like they didn't want to even be bothered. So fine. Got my 20 something dollars back. <laughs> but AliExpress, my home life store, I ordered it on 1130. I think that was the day after Black Friday or was it the Black Friday? Yeah, I think it was Black Friday. It shipped on 12.5, so they were probably backlogged, which I don't get mad about stuff like that. Received it today, first thing in the morning. Like at 8 o'clock, I get something saying, your Amazon package was delivered, because my husband ordered something from Amazon for me. That's another Donna painting, but that's Christmas. I don't want to know what it is. It's a surprise. I like surprises. So that alerted me to go look at my back door, and this package was here. It never updated in the tracking that it was delivered yet, but I think that's awesome. So four notebooks, one special diamond painting. I put down colors because that's what the main colors are in on the front of the covers. But they also had numbers. So 11, 17, 21, and 1. So these, this is the prices. These are the prices. I can't talk right. I'm sorry. I can't talk <laughs> disclaimer um, so one was 549 573 573 588 I will be sharing which one is which and the special diamond painting was 397 originally 2680 42 cents for all this which wasn't bad um, I had a coupon or it was just a savings I think it was just a savings for um, a Black Friday sale so three forty-five was taken off, but then now we're getting taxed. So a dollar forty-four tax. So it came to twenty-five twenty-one, which is not bad because on 
Amazon, I was looking these up. It's almost $12 a notebook. So it's from my home, one word, life store. All right, let's get into it. I'm talking enough. Blah, 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 blah. All right. But I feel I can vent to you guys because, you know, we all know how it is with ordering and, and going through things. You guys are awesome. You know, we all go through the same thing when we're ordering and we just want to get everyone the full detail and scoop. All right, let's see. Oh, nice bubble wrap. That's cool. Yeah, because I bought, <laughs> I did one out last night and I bought emergency gifts and I was going to give these to them after the Christmas holiday. Two of these are going to them. The other two is going to go to church members. Just as, you know, I've been doing one diamond painting per female church member. So that's what I've been doing. Just a gift, nothing like for Christmas or anything. Just, just to give out. All right. So that's the first one. That one's pretty. That's the dream one. I called it the dream. It's a dream catcher. Now this one you can't see because... The diamonds are in the way. So we'll show you this one first, and I'll let you know which one this is. All right. Um, they're not really marked, so I'm going to have to put these back. Yeah, they're not marked. You would think this one will be marked with the number that is with it shipped, because it says number 11. So this is the green. I call it the green because a lot of the colors on the front cover are green. And so you would think the 11 will match. This one was $5.49. The dream catcher one is $5.73. The blue, as you can tell why I call it blue, was $5.73. And the yellow, because it has yellow flowers on the outside, that one is $5.88. Now what I was saying, they all come with a standard kit. No baggies, just a piece of wax. All right, what I was talking about was HMO 19. You would think it would be HMO 11, but it says 19. So you have a bunch of different green rounds. You have one teardrop shape, it looks like. And the rest are rounds. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. It looks like, I should only have six colors. So we got one, two, three, four, A, O, X. All right, sorry, I had a phone call, it was my dad. Okay, so while I was on the phone with him, I was looking at my drills, they're all accounted for. So you got one, two, three, four, and then it switches to letters A, I don't know if that's an O or a zero, C, H, X, and then they have a number seven. Now I couldn't find a number seven on the notebook, but I noticed there are two B's here, which that's probably what it's for, because I only have three, and I only see two, two B's. So that's that one. I'm just going to keep this separate. So that one was $5.49. All right. The second one, the Dream Catcher, was $5.73. These are very clear. I'll probably do a light coating of the Krylon gloss finish spray that I have. So this is why this tonight I want to get this done and then air it out and so they don't stinky, stinky. Same kit. Nothing special. And so, I think these are more like sketchbooks, but you can always write notes down in them. That's this one. A lot of pinks, it looks like. So, same thing um, on the package. It kind of makes no sense, Ange. 
This says 011. But when you order it, it's called, it's basically notebook 17. So it's pretty weird, but it seems like everything's adding up so far with the drills. Take a look at the drills real quick. It looks like I should have up to seven. So yeah, it looks right. This is backwards, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And while I do a quick scan, it seems like seven is the largest number on here. I'm not seeing a number eight. So this one will be probably a little easier to deal with because you don't have like different numbers and with, mixed with letters. I don't know which one I'm gonna give to the teachers yet. I mean, one teacher in the, in the bus driver. I think the dream catcher will give, I'll give to one of them. And this blue one, maybe I'll give to the teacher. Here's the blue one. This one's 573 and it's called number 21. And the largest number on here looks to be eight or nine. That might be six. That might be nine. Is there number six anywhere else? Don't mind me, I'm looking through the viewfinder. So yeah, I think that might be number six. So let's check out the drills real quick. I'm gonna get onto the other notebook and then I'll do this diamond painting. Choo -choo -choo -choo. Come here, come here, where are you? Yeah, I don't like rushing, but I have to be at my daughter's school by 9.30 and it's 8.50, but getting to her school only takes like five minutes. So we have one, AA015, that don't match the number either, it's 21. One, two, three, four, five. And then we have little baggies here. So yeah, six. Seven and eight. Those are pretty. So that's that notebook right there. I'm trying to keep them separate. So I'm gonna like put in these in different spots <laughs> in my kitchen. I don't wanna get anything mixed up. Last but not least, the yellow notebook, which was 588, and their number is 01 for this one. I gotta keep these bags for the other ones. Oh, same kit. Sorry, they both they all have the same kit. So let's see. I think the largest number on here is nine. I don't see any letters. So we should have nine drills. So let's get this one out. Same thing with the package. This one though is really plain package, but it does not match the notebook. So that's different. Oh, these are so pretty. Sorry. <laughs> I like these. These are cute. I've never seen these before. So this is the first for me. Then we have number two are the red ones number three which are the larger red and four five there they are six it's like a green and seven eight nine those are the notebooks. Now I'm just gonna, my diamond painting is in that box. <laughs> that is for Christmas. Don't touch it. Don't touch it, Ange. All right, let me move some of this stuff off the way so we can look at this diamond painting that I got also from them. It's a special drill. And I will not be keeping the plastic for that one because I like to flatten these out. 
And this is a cute one. I'm, I can't really see, I'm not a butterfly person, but um, this is something I would normally not get, but it stuck out to me and it was really, 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 really pretty. So, let me see. Oops. Trying not to get the glare, but that is pretty. I like that. Okay, they give you a toolkit with the plastic tweezers. Now, oh, I like the purple package. I got to show you this. Uh, PQ013, and that's exactly what it says. I paid $3.97 for this. It says it's a 30 by 40, but I don't think so. Uh, nine shapes, and you have the key on both sides. So these are typical symbols I notice for special drills. So nothing different than what I'm used to. At least they have like a universal thing, uh, symbol for drills I've noticed. Like nobody's using anything really weird. It's kind of the same, the two diamonds and a, and a circle and the X in a circle and an up symbol in the circle, teardrops. So this is a pretty package. It kind of matches the butterflies, isn't that gorgeous? The pink and the silver. So we have one and two are both purple, one seems lighter. Uh, the blue, these are like silverish leaf shaped. I don't know like the fancy names. Round, yeah, those are, I'm trying to do a close up here. Can you please zoom in? Going on here. There. Oh, that's why. All right, we got one big giant one for six. <laughs> Seven are these light lavender teardrops. Eight, I can see through the package, are these nice orangey rounds. And nine are these oh my, purplish. A, is that AB or iridescence? I'm not sure. Like I said, I don't. I'm not all fancy like that, so. <laughs> but you know, this is gonna be pretty. And I have nothing against butterflies. It's just I don't know. Butterflies are pretty and everything, but they're just not like the first thing I will gravitate to, unless it's a really pretty diamond painting. But let's measure this real quick, and I am done with the craziness. <laughs> All right, so let's do side to side. It claims to be a 30 by 40. So it is actually a 24. Now we're gonna have to flatten this out so we get an accurate reading here. 24 by 34. So it is off by six centimeters on each side. So that's probably the full canvas. But that is it. For my quick little video, I know I haven't done one in a while. I think I have another diamond painting, but I also will share what I got for Christmas in another video. So AliExpress, again, my home life store. Those are the prices, $3.97, 42 cents shipping, which wasn't bad. So you, I got the four notebooks and the diamond painting for $25.21, which I didn't think was bad at all. And that was it. I'm pretty sure I won't have another diamond painting. Sorry, I'm going to move you guys. Um, I won't have another diamond painting for you guys or a video before Christmas. So I want to say Merry Christmas. And this is the one I'm still working on. I only have this left. I tried to start it yesterday, but then I had a barrage of phone calls that <sighs> stressed me out. But the problem I'm having real quick before I end the video... Drill's not fitting again. I don't know what's going on. I'm trying to figure out where I'm at. Right here. So the squares could not fit in those little teeny spots. So I dabbed the glitter in there. I don't have a lot of spots like that. So far only two. But from far away you cannot notice I am missing drills. But like, look how small that is. That's like a quarter of a drill, not even 
So I'm like, how am I going to fit? So I'm trying to push them over maybe. <laughs> I try to cover the spot, the pink drills, but it was not working. But I'm having so many popping issues. And this is from Evershine, but the drills are from the Hankins Painting Store because they sent me the wrong canvas. It's supposed to be around. They sent me a square and then they resent the canvas. It was a mess, but like I said, I'm not getting into that. So I got the drills and I didn't want to throw the canvas out. So I got the drills from the Hankins Painting Store. And I'm trying to make it work, but like I said, I'm almost done. So that's not like so much of a big deal. It's just some of them are popping a little bit here and there and I got to push them down and I went over it with the rolling pin and everything and they're still popping. But this is the one I'm going to compare with the square and the round. I already finished the round and I want to finish this to compare and it's been over two months and I haven't completed it yet. But other than that, have a happy holiday. Merry Christmas. Thank you for watching. And I hope everybody is safe. Have a good day. Bye. Well, hello, Diamond Painters. I just want to let you know that I have finished this notebook. On the same day, it took me about, about an hour and a half to do eight symbols. I'm trying not to get any shadow. I think it came out awesome. Very sparkly. I am going to seal it with the Krylon um, sealer and gloss. I'm going to do that now and then I'll show you what it looks like after. So we can get a before and after. So I think that came out really good. I'm trying to get the sparkle. And the reason why I'm going to seal it is you can see in the light all that glue that's shining. So I just want to get it sealed and I'm going to start the next one and I'll do a before clip of that one too because I'm going to let them sit outside even though it's freezing here but I want to get that spray paint stench off of them and since this is so last minute I did not have time to go to the store and get any other type of sealer so I hope this came out comes out good so yeah I didn't have any problems with the drills. I had enough, more than enough, of the very small rhinestones. Um, this symbol was green before you put the gold on. And I was thinking at first, like, that's pretty weird. But the gold actually came out very nice. All right, I'm going to go seal this. <laughs> I could talk about it for hours. But yeah, I'm up in my bedroom, so excuse me that everything looks a little different. But everyone's downstairs and they're on the loud side, so. Alright, so I'll be back with the other one, and then we'll do an after with them sealed. Alright, this is the before. Alright, well this is the after effect. I'm sorry, I'm not doing an after of the other notebook because I already wrapped it up and put it in my daughter's backpack right there for her teacher. We're leaving in about a half hour to go catch the school bus and my one track mine kicked in and I forgot to do an after I sprayed. I'm so sorry, but yeah, that's my curse. <laughs> I get one track mine and try to get things done that I forget certain things. So I want to say I'm sorry. But this is what I used on the, um, the notebook covers. This I got from Home Depot for less than $4. I have sealed um, 260 by 40s already with this. 
two notebooks, several other small diamond paintings. So this had lasted me a long time. But this is what it looks like after. And I'm sorry I was so quiet in the before clip. It was just in my daughters were still sleeping. And I didn't want to be too loud. So this is the after. So the whole cover looks shiny now. Not just the parts that were are sticky. And this is not sticky at all. And the drills still look shiny. Oops, sorry, my finger's in the way, which I like. And they don't move. So as long as they don't move, I know they're not going to come off. So, But I'm sorry about the other notebook. I forgot to do an after I sprayed it to show you. But it came out the same way. It's not moving. It's still sparkly. And that's about it. This is not, shouldn't be a very long video, I hope. But I have a bunch of clips. So <laughs> I'm going to put them all together for you guys. So a recap. Uh, this is the store off of AliExpress, my home life store. I did the Dream Catcher, which is $5.73, and then the blue one, which is also $5.73. And today's Friday, the Friday before Christmas. Kids, kids do not have school next week, so that's another reason why I have a one-track mind to get things done and gifts put in her backpack and off to school with her because... I won't see anybody until January 2nd, so it will be awkward giving a gift afterwards. It would seem like I had an afterthought, and I don't want them to think they were an afterthought, because they're not. And I'm also sending a package of Milano cookies, so I know those are one of my favorite. And to snack on during the holiday season, which would be awesome. <laughs> so, who doesn't love cookies with a gift? Come on now. <laughs> just kidding everyone has different preferences so that was it i want to say thank you for watching i am very happy to have viewers um i don't do this like i said for money or recognition or anything like that through youtube or through people sending me products because nobody has which i don't expect i do this i just want to share you know i just love watching everyone else's video and them sharing their opinion and i think it's awesome I just sometimes when I watch a video and people just make it seem like, well, I'm this big YouTuber with a million subscribers, basically. This is why they send me free stuff. To me, that's a an off switch for me. And when people get like that, especially with this craft, which is basically this craft is to make people unstress, is to help them with certain certain things to get away from. You know, certain things that are bothering you, it's supposed to be relaxing. And when I'm listening to people, when I'm trying to relax, and they're puffing themselves up, it's like, mm, it's a turn off for me. <laughs> I have, to be honest, unsubscribed to one person because of the way they came out in their videos, and this was a long time ago. And sometimes you just want to feed people humble pie. But I normally will only comment positive. I will not comment, comment on something negative because we have an, enough negativity in our life. So I want to say thank you for watching. I never thought I'll get almost 200 subscribers. That's awesome. But if I ever get too big headed, please feed me some humble pie. <laughs> have a happy holidays. Thank you for watching. Merry Christmas. Bye.